Okay, summer is here, and I'm gonna share with you one of my easiest outfit hacks, style tricks, whatever you wanna call it, one of my favorite summer outfits that's super easy, it feels really good, it feels really elevated, and it lets you, lets you embrace your like beachy mermaid vibe. So with the outfit destruction, hey Lenny, uh, with the outfit destruction, as I always do, I'm gonna take a step back and show you guys the full outfit, and then I'm gonna break down how I created it to give you inspiration to pull pieces from your closet. So as I was saying, this is one of my favorite things to wear for summer. So let me take a quick step back. I think you guys can see the shoes on this. I did a little test so that you can see. Um, and it's really, really easy. So let me break it down how I got dressed. And um, like I said, so you can kind of, this is so that you can go into your closet and pull pieces that are similar to feel inspired. So let's start with the last thing that I just th threw on. And don't worry, this is totally G rated. I'm not going to get completely undressed here, but I'm just going to show you. I'm going to deconstruct. So the last thing that I threw on is a jean jacket and it gets chilly here in SoCal um, in the evening or even sometimes during the day. So depending on where you are, you may or may not need this last piece. But I always love to just have a jean jacket with me. Super easy to cape over your shoulders like I did. This kind of gives you that like cool girl vibe. Like I'm, I'm trying, but I'm not really trying. Um, super easy way to just keep yourself warm when it gets a little bit chilly. So I caped that over and I specifically picked my lighter denim wash to really tie back to the deeper teal in the skirt. I didn't wanna do super blue because I didn't feel like that would look great with the, um, with the teal. So let's take that off so that you can see what I've got on underneath. So underneath, this is literally one of my easiest hacks is to stock up on these, these like white, kind of like an old school Hanes tank. We used to call them wife beaters. I don't think that's politically correct to call them that, but it's like that Hanes boys tank, um, but these are these are women's. You can get these. This one is actually from Target. Yes, a lot of my basics cotton pieces, I totally get at Target. Uh, you can also get this at Madewell if you wanna invest a little bit more, and I think the Madewell ones are also organic cotton, which is, I'm gonna start buying from Madewell as well. Um, so super easy to throw on, just a really great, white tank with, excuse me, with a maxi skirt. Such an easy summer vibe. This maxi skirt happens to be a little bit sheer at the bottom. It's also got a fun little slit on the side so you get some nice air going on. Um, super easy vibe to throw on for the summer so that you feel like you've put a little bit more effort into it, yet you're literally wearing like a white cotton tank top on top. So I always say tuck it in, especially when you're doing a looser, maxi skirt vibe like this that's kind of flowy this is where you want to be really cognizant of your proportions so if you're doing something that's a little bit flowier on the bottom then you're going to want something that's a little bit more fitted on the top and you're going to want to tuck in i know a lot of the ladies watching tucking in you feel like you don't want to tuck in that you know you feel uncomfortable showing like tucking stuff in and like drawing attention to your midsection and I will say it actually is more slimming when you tuck in because it helps with your proportions and it actually draws your eye in a lot of times when you don't tuck in it actually like creates more um you're just creating like a wider vibe to you so just play with it that's something I invite you to play with this summer and then um the last thing I did I threw on this really cute pair of slides they have kind of that teal color that's in the skirt. They've got this fun little wooden bottom. You could also totally do, I felt like wearing a little bit of a heel because the skirt's kind of long. You could also totally do a little slide sandal as well, depending on your comfort level. Um, I felt like wearing a little heel today. I went out to lunch and I wanted to get a little dolled up. So that's the base of the outfit, super easy. Again, you could wear white, you could do black, you could do gray, and then pair it back to any of your maxi skirts, whatever color, if you have some that are printed. This is just such a super easy vibe. And then where you get to play is with your accessories. What I always say, accessories are really how you take your outfit to the next level, how you add your pizzazz, um, how you really make it yours. So I threw on some of my layering necklaces. I always have my little queen on. I always have my little diamond A. And then I added my Lumerian crystal with it as well because since the neckline is a little bit higher on this, it was kind of, it's kind of fun to play with um, some draping with the necklace and some layering with the necklace. So I could have also done a big statement necklace if I wanted to. I felt like doing the, the longer draping. And then um, with earrings, I actually kind of went with more of the studs because I'm playing with this fun little chain right here. 
um, this little like dangly between some of my piercings. So I went with more of the studs so that the dangle could really have the, the day in the part, you know, like the dangle was like what you're really noticing. And then added, of course, some of my bracelet stackers because my arms were bare. Um, and then just layered up with rings. With rings, I always like to have one hand that has some more delicate layers to it and then the other hand that has more of a statement piece to it. That's what I did today. Let's see, is there anything I'm forgetting? Um, I think that's it, you guys, but that's just a super easy look. Again, I'll, I'll finish by, by caping the jacket back on. Super easy look um, to really just, I don't know, if you're going out, you're meeting, meeting someone for lunch, you're meeting someone for dinner and you wanna look pulled together. And then the last thing that I will show you that I did have with me today is my purse. Let me grab that forgot about that little last element. And this is also where you can have some fun because the rest of my outfit was pretty, you know, like no prints today. I was playing with my solids. So I had fun with my purse, which has a lot of fun color in it. The little guitar strap. It's got the fun tassels to it. It's got some colors there. So I threw this baby on with it and I was ready to go. I actually had it on under the jacket. You just kind of do that and there's like the full there's the full vibe kind of like that boho vibe but still really elevated and remember it's it's also about how it makes you feel right i was feeling a skirt today i felt like dressing up i felt like feeling really pulled together i kind of wanted that like mermaid boho vibe and so that's what i went for so that's what you get to imagine and really think about before you get dressed is like how do i want to feel today in my clothes who do i want to embody how do i want to show up for the day okay what in my wardrobe can I put on that will make me feel like that? And this is just one great option for you if you've got some fun maxi skirts to play with and you want them to be a little bit more casual. Okay, hope you enjoyed. Many more outfit destructions coming your way. As always, go forth stylishly. Bye.